Alright, for this week's challenge mode, I thought I'd do a play-by-play -play instead of a traditional quote-unquote guide. So, for this encounter, what you want to do is split up into three teams of two, and then you make a line. So, for example, this scan operates a press. I will be starting at scan, and I'll have one teammate that's with me at all times when swapping buffs. So, in this case, it's me and Knight. We're going to start scan. I will do it, then he'll do scan. Then I will now pick up operator because it's the next thing in the chain. So, one to the right. So it'll be scan, operate, suppress for us, while the other two teams start at operate or suppress and then move one to the right. Now, what you want to do in this encounter specifically is when you lose your augment, you want to put it in to the machine because then you have a cooldown or a lockout. And then what you can do to help that is when your operator shoots the bombs, is you hold off to picking them up a couple seconds because it buys your uh, augmented deactivated player a couple of seconds to lose their debuff. And then you don't have to worry about like standing what side of the room, which place where. You just need to know this team picks up this, that team picks up that, third team picks up the third thing, and then you rotate one to the right. Obviously you want to talk during all this. I'm just having them deafen for the purpose of, you know, you guys hearing me. And then that's pretty much it. Just rotate cycle out, play your life. Don't die with a deactivated buff, because if you die with a deactivated buff, the challenge will fail, even if it doesn't actually say it fails. If you die with a charge buff, you can get revived and just pick it up again, and then it shouldn't fail the challenge. Just don't die when you're deactivated. When you are deactivated, call it out and say, I'm putting my thing in, because the deactivated person needs to put it in first in order to have their cooldown start. Otherwise, you're just gonna be standing there with a dead uh, augment and your timer still hasn't started while the counter continues. And that's it, just uh, rotate for six rounds. Every two rounds you get a different buff with your one teammate and that's it, you're good. So right here, uh, I should be getting operator from, there you go. So now I am on the second buff and you replay the same chain. So I'm gonna be operator. Whenever everything's ready, I'm going to shoot the button. And then that'll start the process all over again. I'm sure you already know that part. So, bam. The bombs are over there. Give them a couple of seconds. You'll pick them up. They know where to plant. Don't worry about that. Clear some ads. And that's, I mean, it's pretty simple once you're organized. Just do the same thing for your third round, which would be suppressor for me. But I don't think I need to show you guys that. You get the general idea. And then, like I said, don't die, and you'll be fine. It's just organization, that's all it is. So, let's uh, just get to the end, so I'll show that two chests spawn.